you got a, Heather, you got an alert on your phone, right? Yeah, we yeah that it was about. heavy fog till the afternoon. And we're like, oh. And you couldn't see your hand in front of your no, face. It was thick, thick. So anyway, we eat breakfast, fill up gas tanks. We, you know, through a friend, he says, we'll go check out these spots. And then you find out there's cows all over the place, right? Yeah. Could be a good hunting spot. I'm not going to, you ain't going in with the cows. Well, where there's cows, they eat the grass. They graze it down. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Even the rose hips. Mm-hmm. You know, like yeah. the birds were eating. I mean, grasshoppers, rose hips, um, snowberries, snowberries, winter snowberries, berries, winter berries, berries and silver berries. Silver berries, right, Matt? Yeah. <clears throat> and so you're looking for that. And if it's over pastured, yeah. then it would. Yeah. Which, don't get me wrong, we've shot birds right next <coughs> to cows. Like, yeah, we, you did. You did, yeah. But it's just a matter of how long have they been in they there. They might have been in there a day. A day. Yeah, yeah. You don't so know. you just got to look, and if the grass looks like it's been grazed pretty heavily, there's cows all over it, you're like, all right, this is this is okay. Chances are yeah. it's not the best yeah. place to wander yeah. around. Yeah. And we had passed a, a private piece on the way to that pin. Right. Um, that we had just turned the corner, and Helen and I go, whoa, like, that looks good. Like, right. Okay, check the corners. Corners, corners look good. No signs posted. Piece, no signs posted. Mm-hmm. And we kind of made a U-turn, turned around and went back. And we ended up walking that little, it was like a 260-acre piece or something. Yeah. Not huge. And and we mm-hmm. didn't do, well, <clears throat> that's where I whiffed. Muffed. That's where whiffed I whiffed. Did, yeah. Didn't you darn your step on them? They were right in front of you. No, no, they no, were no, they were out, oh, they they were out 30, there. 30, oh, yeah, but they, they were, yards, yeah. they were kind of gimmies because... Actually, I think those birds actually flushed when the other there was a uh, a sharpie off to my left about eighty yards away that flushed and went back toward roof. And I, I think that's what I, I, I think that's what they heard that. Flush. I, think I think they so. heard that flush yeah. too. Okay, because if you know when one sharpie goes up, it's like dah, 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 yeah, dah, dah. it makes a little laugh. And they noise. hear that, and you're like something's wrong. Yeah, go. yeah danger. Gotta get out. Right. Mm-hmm. I hate why those birds hadn't been hunted. They could have heard us, and you know. Birds coming for the last hundred yards. The noise and everybody talking. But the thing that was embarrassing for me, and I've done this a hundred times in my life, I look at it and go like, oh, here we go. You know, and I literally in my head said, I'm getting a double. I wow. mean, that's was in my head. One got up further, but then the other one got up, and as I'm pulling up on that one, I boom. And you just automatically switched birds, didn't you? I, well, an- the, another one got up right behind oh, it. And then because I missed that one, I'm like, how the fuck? Oh, no, and no, I no. should have stayed on the bird I was on. Mm-hmm. And I swung to that bird, and I missed it just then. And I was like, and then you missed it. Yeah, not one. to feel you left out. Yeah, right. I did miss Not to I feel left out. Yeah. I knew because we up. couldn't see you, but I could hear you. And then he was way above me. He's like, did he get it? I'm like, well, he just screamed, son of a bitch. So I don't, <laughs> think, so. So I don't think it went well. <laughs> <laughs> That's <laughs> funny. <laughs> no. Yeah. I heard and, that. <laughs> and I, I was talking to Matt all the way back. Matt was running with his camera. And he goes, Ron, you're preaching to the choir. Because <laughs> I said, man, I'm just going to run this over my head. I'm yeah, boom, it sucks. Boom. Yeah. But so now we had a, a great end of that field, but we don't have a bird. No. But then, so the last hunt, we got to that spot. Mm-hmm. And you put Heather and I. Yeah, well, my thinking was, <laughs> I'll put Heather with Ron. Heather can run Kip. Mm-hmm. And I can run whiskey. And Kip works good with Heather. Yep, Kip can, she can run him, she can handle him just fine. And Bill and I can walk together. Because I know that if Heather and Ron are together, they see a pretty flower and Heather goes, Ron, look at this flower. Ron, <laughs> run over there, let's look, look, look at this. Not and look the, at and any the, flowers. And what were they doing at the end? Bill and I were like, what the what fuck the are they, they doing? Do? We Here they are with Those were legitimate the, things. The... They were roosts and a duck nest. Oh, yeah. yeah. Heather found these unbelievable, like this one area that had, there must have been days worth of days of roosting yeah. in the same Got spot. Things. And then you found a, a duck nest mm-hmm. that hashed out. You don't see that every yeah. day. Yeah, that's and, cool. But you guys are the over pictures. there. It was the really trucks, cool. about, and just trucks are 400 and yards away. There could be birds down at that bottom. Like there was one more yeah, possible, one more possible, possible spot. And yeah. finally Trent goes, what are you guys doing? Yeah, come on. <laughs> Get going. When we were on top of them hills out there in the middle of that, and the fog was just rolling and the wind was whipping, like we kept, I kept saying, I'm like, it doesn't even feel like we're in North Dakota. It feels yeah, like we're on top of the you said, let's take yeah. a picture up here. It just looks like we're on top of the It looks bizarre, yeah, because yeah, you couldn't see anywhere. 
So we were walking that first little, I think two, three birds got up out of, you know, out of range and yeah. Kip didn't get a chance to point them. And then, so you guys come back across the fence and we started working one piece and we had to start, we had to turn to our right to go back to the truck at one point. Right. Otherwise we were gonna go too far and then we were gonna run into a big slough, a big wet hole. That we didn't want to have time. They were always yeah. just yelling at us. They were. Move here, go Move this here. way. Move here. What do you mean they? they? I didn't have any then, <laughs> So Heather and I, you know, we're both saying, let's, you know, let's just go to the bar. <laughs> in fact, she screwed. I told place. I told Heather today that you and Roof went to the bar. She goes, "He better not have left without me. I want to go to a bar." <laughs> yeah, she has been saying that all week. <laughs> and so Heather and I are like, we're in this fog bank, and you guys are off to the right. You're telling us to come that yeah, way. You gotta swing around. And I'm like. Oh, sure, we'll just run right up this. And that was a yeah. steep hill. <laughs> Remember I said, we'll just, Heather and I'll just run right up this hill to keep up with long legs over here. <laughs> and uh, and a bird gets up. And I think we both, well, did you think we could even hit him? No. No. They, I'm, but you can't not try. You, well, you miss every shot you don't take. Yeah. But we both raise our guns and we both let him go. And... Out of all them birds, I mean, there was no doubt they were hit. Like, birds were getting up, patoof, patoof. The only thing we had going for us is the wind, because they, yeah, they took they, them a second once, right, they up, they that that hill, once they got up. You're right, because once they cleared that hill, they stalled out for a second because they came. Is that up. why we got them? <laughs> it was like target practice. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a pattern target. Yeah. But anyway, I said we got two birds down, and then you guys started coming our way. No, 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 no. No, we we guys didn't start coming that way. You said we got two down. Trent well, drops his phone. Yeah, and he runs I was up the goddamn hill. To yeah, because one just bounced and basically. No, no, no. They both hit the ground. And then it came back up. Yeah, and then I don't know if you didn't see it. Trent was trying to come into the action because I had and, seen one land, looked injured, but I so I wanted to get to it and right. Like, well, the point and, I'm trying to make is. He goes running up the hill like a fucking white-tailed deer. I did that. Yeah. And he right. drops his phone. I'm like, I, 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 I got to do that? I can't do that. that. I'm out. I'm out. Because yeah. I was looking at my phone at Onyx to get us you know, oriented in the right direction to head back right. to Right, but then action happens. And all of a sudden I hear all these Sharpies get up and I just... Just instinctively, just throw it on the ground. No, oh. we have these ground. discussions about not dropping stuff. Right, well, the well, that's there. just what happens. Like so I Bill, just get rid of it. So Bill, you took your phone, you chucked it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I guess <laughs> we'll just. No, this is what we do. No, <laughs> just throw, throw the phones away. I wasn't it. gonna run up that. I couldn't run up that hill. I wasn't throwing my phone. I wasn't getting in that. Both birds went like to get up. The one bird on the left, you could see it had a broken it. wing. Mm-hmm. It couldn't do it, and the other one got wind mm-hmm. and flew where? Right, right at me. Right at you. <laughs> Bad idea. Yeah. Yeah, we, yeah, I took care of that one. And you, and you pasted that one, and then, uh, so we're, now we're all happy. Now we got to go back and look for Yeah, so now phone. we got two birds in hand, and we're like, well, no now phone. i got to go back and look for my phone because... And I Heather just, goes, I don't know how you don't find your phone on Apple. No, I called him a few times, and then I finally pulled it up. I never knew you could do that. I'm like, so oh, look, this iPhone? dot's me, and then there's Trent yeah. over there. But you had just found it did when I finally find, pulled it up. You found the phone. Yeah, yeah he found it. it. Yeah. Did you find it because of the? it was beeping or ringing? He just seen it. You just seen it. Yeah. I mean, we were like Hawkeye. I swear to God, yeah, I found that... Grouchy shot. There it is. There it is. I'll keep you around. (laughs) Uh, We're all kind of chatty and yakky. We're basically planning on just walking back. Of course, you never know where a bird's going to be. But we we know enough to know, like, with that wind, they're going to be on the leeward side of the hill. And now we're going into the wind. And now we're going into the wind. So anywhere there's a leeward side, Mm -hmm. which would be facing us going out, or a depression Mm -hmm. where you feel the wind go away, and we're all like, bit, 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 bit. Talking about what just happened. And there's Kip on point. Yup. <laughs> and we're almost like, what's he doing? Yeah. <laughs> and the puppy. Yeah. Naturally back in. That was Nab- Nab- Honestly, I don't know if we would have noticed ground. Kip if Whiskey hadn't No, I think back. you're right. I think we saw Whiskey. Like, what's he what's doing? He, doing? And he almost thinks like a kid. young dog, like, pees with your legs yeah. straight. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Well, and we, gave, we gave him a quick lesson of this earlier in the week. 
Kip was on point. We had seen it happening, and then Whiskey was still running. So then I started going towards Kip, and I had Whiskey, a control of Whiskey on my hip. Yeah. And as soon as I watched Whiskey working, and as soon as he made eye contact with Kip, wham! I touched him with the with the neck, which right. is, means. But whoa. he was already whoa, He was already. Yeah, right. he, I'm saying, he, he had a he had, oh, a, he had a lesson earlier, earlier in, the week. in the week. You know, I yeah. nicked him real quick, and he whoa! You know, he's he's real good with the nick and the whoa. Right. He slams on whoa, and now he's staring straight like. Uh, 90 degrees to Kip, so you can see right. Kip standing there. Yeah, and then I come around behind Kip. One bird gets up, I shoot it, and so now whiskey just seen the whole and, thing. And that's play what it out. takes for a dog. It's yeah. got like a sequence happens. They don't forget that. Stuff. No, he did not. And because the next today. day yeah. we were trying to hunt them together, and he would like run. Where's Kip? Run. Where's Kip? Yeah. So we had to peel yeah, away from each split. other. But then today, today, boom, boom. Yeah, naturally back. A true back. Gorgeous. There was no way with that wind that. Whiskey was he smelling. Could the, smell it a little maybe, bit. Maybe, yeah. but it, it looked like a back to me, yeah, and I, yeah. mm-hmm. I think I could judge a back pretty yeah. good. Yeah, you never know. My dog didn't back me. Did. Anyway, so <laughs> that bird gets up. We have this bird triangulated in this little valley, and I mean a small valley. Heather and our Heather gun and my gun goes off at the exact same exact time. same time. I literally didn't know that anybody else shot because right. I never heard another. And you when you pulled the trigger, you saw the bird go down. Yeah, I was like, "Oh, sweet, I got it." Right. And then I was like, "They're like, oh, I shot and I shot." And I'm like, "Well." And <laughs> I shot, and Trent shot about a what, an eighth of a second, a nanosecond, a nanosecond yeah. after, because you could, you're closer to Trent. So yeah, it was you, Heather, me, and Trent, and Trent, and this poor bird. <laughs> He, he went like he went <laughs> <laughs> like, like I think we can find that one. Yeah, it's so sucks. now I mean, we're all suck. excited. Yeah, well, you, know, you hate to, but then we could all have been standing there with our thumbs up our butt, like, oh, I thought you were shooting. I thought you were shooting. If, if, yeah, if, if you know it's a safe a shot, bit. you yeah. take it. Yeah, and they get up into the wind. Yeah. Uh, anyway, yeah. there was nothing wrong with it, and I'll bet you there's still good meat on. Oh yeah, we have, yeah. yeah, I'm yeah. sure there is. Yeah. But. It got pasted hard. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I, I like those grouse feet. Grouse feet are good eating. <laughs> <laughs> grouse feet and the beaks. Well, yeah. you know, our grandma grouse used to use chicken soup. feet. Though. Yeah, I know. I know. Your That's grandma used chicken feet. Actually, didn't they call your grandma chicken foot? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we grew up in Chicago. Well, <laughs> we, we, on the one side of the family, we were part indigenous people. That was Grandma Chickenfoot. Oh, that's right. Grandma Chickenfoot. Indigenous. I'm surprised you got that word right in one try. How'd she get that name? Well, she had bunnies. First thing they saw when she was born. <laughs> she was brief birth. <laughs> she, didn't, she didn't have chicken feet. That was her name. Oh! <laughs> I remember your Grandma McCarthy. Yeah. You know, we, you know who we haven't talked about is, is Matt and Chubbs. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Yeah. Matt talks well, about Matt they've and Chubbs. Talk, they've talked to each other a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I've they heard some of the conversations. Sometimes I when he's outside, I said, Matt, Mark, he goes, no, nothing. I was <laughs> having a little conversation with Chubbs. <laughs> oh, that's, been the, that's been the thing all week is Chubbs going for rides. Yeah. It, it, you have to understand, and that dog is in my office all day. Oh, he's you know, your he's left hand. Yeah, he's, he's your left talking. hand. Yeah, yeah. So you kind of just get into this weird thing. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, I, I get my dogs in kind of what's a tiger? What are we doing today? I, I do that. But you do it like a little more conversationally, <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, I hear like, it, I hear it every morning. He'll say like, like Chubbs. It's not time to get up yet. (laughs) 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 You're bunking with it in the room. (laughs) And I look over and I see Chubb standing up and then it's not time to get up yet. (laughs) (laughs) Oh man, that's great. I I never heard Matt go like, hey Chubbs, you wanna eat? (laughs) Was he expecting a yes? I kind of think he does, though, because he could, you know, I could eat, I could eat. You know. <laughs> Man, you know, it's a house dog, 100%. Turned into a good hunting dog. I mean, right? I mean, a functional hunting dog, right? He's functional, I mean, yeah. He point birds, he's not letting you down. But he is so much a part of your family that it's almost, and I, and I you know, I love busting your balls about it, but I can't help it because I'm like, He's like, well, I'm going to run into town. I said, well, yeah, we got two hours before we go out tonight. He says, 
well, I'm going to take Chubbs. I'm like, well, he's in the kennel rusting in the garage. He goes, yeah, but he likes car rides. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how do you actually know? It helps him rest. <laughs> all the sleep he's here. We should our kids all the time. Just go for a ride. Yeah. Maybe I'll. <laughs> <laughs> he just has these things like he's still eating out of the puppy dish. <laughs> like he's still, he's nine years old. <laughs> that's like your, that's like going to Christmas dinner and forever being on the little table. The little table, yeah, the little kid's table. <laughs> <laughs> he's got this, 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 the puzzle bowl. That'll make a puzzle bowl. <laughs> this, this is slow bowl. <laughs> slow bowl. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, we, we use those bowls with puppies. He's, 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 he's probably got a sippy cup with his name on it. And the cup holder. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but I'll say I remember meeting Matt and Chubbs, I don't know, maybe six, seven years ago. Probably at least yeah, six. Fifteen. Was it fifteen? Might have been. Might it has been a long time. And Chubbs was not Chubbs that you see now. Chubbs is just more like a, like I don't want to say he's abnormal, but I think you you have got him so like your partner. He's actually like more like, nope, Matt hasn't said anything to me yet. <laughs> no, because when we went to New York, he was more kind of like out there and just like you didn't talk to him as much. Maybe. I don't, yeah. I no, I mean, I, in my oh, mind, so mind's right. I don't remember you being, the I, only thing I do remember you is when we go hunting sometimes, you're like, Chubbs could be out like 150 yards. I can see Chubbs with my eyes. And Matt's looking this thing. <laughs> how far? How far? Where is he? I'm like, Matt is right here. <laughs> I remember that New York trip where we took him out for the first time and he was gone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he was just doing huge circles. He was just by. In the thick grouse woods. <laughs> right. Yeah. In New York. Yeah. Can't, can't see anything. anything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. That's been an adventure with Chubbs. <laughs> but you killed birds with him this week. I did? Yeah. yeah. And I pointed. Did. Pointed birds. Yeah, that's never been an issue with No, me. no, but I mean, like, I'm hoping for that. Yeah. You know? And I always say if they haven't handled that species yet, it takes a... He, he's old enough. He's smart enough. He's got the instincts. He smelled a bird. He's like, oh, oh. You know, like, my dog's got great pointing instinct. He doesn't know what he's doing, you know. Yeah. And I, when you came back, he said, yep, got double down grouse. Like, what? That can't hit a barn if he was standing inside of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking one of the grouse had to hit a telephone. <laughs> They flew into each other, knocked each other out. It was like they had to wring their necks. <laughs> they were stuck. Oh. Oh. You know, you know, what I saw today, I, I mean, we were up, we didn't get any birds today, but the one thing that made me happy that I've been seeing more and more of him is he didn't used to wait for me when he was on point. Now I was probably about eighty yards away from him. He was on point. He held staunch. He waited till I got there. Right. And he's been being very consistent about that. Right. So I've been... And that's what most people have for a dog. It's a staunch dog. Let you... Let you in on the action. Yeah. 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 I mean, he, as soon as that bird takes off... He oh, off that's that's races. all obedience yeah. after that. Yeah. But the Roof, your takeaway, though. Let, let's wrap this up. Roof got out real quick. Roof got out. He got late. He got in here late. Got in here We're going to be the, hunting tomorrow the, the and Saturday. With the TKR, so I couldn't do a lot of walking. TKR right there. This no, one. that one. Okay. Titanium Man. Titanium. That's what my wife calls me now, Titanium Man. <laughs> titanium <laughs> Man. Well, I asked the surgeon, you got anything left over if you want to have them, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and then the only thing is you're going to have to hinge it, or otherwise it'll be like Pinocchio. <laughs> you're going to have to hinge it. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I got a little bunny. <laughs> <laughs> so you went out for a little walk today. I went out for a little walk, didn't shoot, felt good to walk, walked about a little over a half mile one time. Quarter After mile a knee another. replacement. After knee replacement, feel good. So tomorrow? Tomorrow we're going to hit it hard. Hit it hard. Hit it hard. Watch out for holes. Watch out for holes. That's the biggest Didn't you thing. also tell your doctor you were looking for a little blue pill or something like that? Oh, well, that's when we went with the titanium. Okay. <laughs> well, I thought it was about shaving or something about it. Oh, no. No? You don't remember that one? I don't remember that. I, I remember that story. <laughs> you went to your doctor. You said, I'm feeling a little tired. Oh, I see. He said, yeah, you maybe check my blood pressure. And oh, my feeling. my anatomy wasn't working well. He used to watch me shave. Now it's like, <laughs> get, him, get him to come out. <laughs> That's not the way you said it. <laughs> the doctor's a family-rated podcast. <laughs> Matt can always cut this up. His words were, I went to the doc. I said, hey, uh, you know. Wouldn't mind a little help down south there a little bit. He goes, you having problems with erectile dysfunction? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm just, just, he goes, what do you mean? Pressure, it's not a lot the- of pressure at work. <laughs> <laughs> he says, well, what do you mean? He goes, I don't know. Doc, he says, when I was young, you used to watch me shave. <laughs> That's a wrap. <laughs>